All right, so let's jump into the uh, game itself. We'll pick up where we left off, uh, which is chamber 21 of 25, I do believe, is where we got up to. What about here? I heard a turret. Uh-oh. I heard turrets. Good news. We found a way to make these turrets more durable. They should now also work in the future. Oh, great. Most of them, anyway. Go on, crazy. Should you Welcome find on. a defective turret you in the future, feel free to mark this as a flaw in your test report. All right, so. Activated. Are you still we can block these Good off. Night. And yes, I'm pretty sure what we're going to want to do here is something along the lines of. Oh, I may need to go back first, though. Uh, let's start this bit again, shall we? Because that was a huge flop on my part. But effectively, I think what we're going to do is go across here. Like so. And use our time portal we want to use the time portal on there first but effectively we're going to use time portal uh, maybe we need to swap dimensions first ourselves yeah we can use a time portal like that and that that's effectively how we're going to go out of the chamber here. You finish it twice. Nice. And then to finish up, we're going to want to do portal here, I guess, right? Because we're going to want to use the light bridge. So yeah, we need to get the cube. First and foremost, we need to get a cube. Okay. So, just... Oh. Okay, so I wonder. Pretty sure you're not meant to catch it. World record is 16 minutes. Interesting. <clears throat> All right, so then we need a portal there. actually think we're probably going to want to change this though, shouldn't we? We're actually going to want to do portal there instead. But we can easily rectify that by going through the time and doing that, because that will then reshoot that in the right position, won't it? So we'll do that. Walk across here.
feel like I'm probably shock horror overcomplicating things here. No, right? Who'd have thunk it? Not overcomplicating a puzzle. this a moment ago. Now not so much so. Crazy, thank you very much for the host. Right, sorry about that. Uh, yeah, I did notice that the portal gun always shows green doctress. I had noticed that. Oed, oed, oed. Alright, so I've got to do that. Now, you know, I didn't think to check. I know. But was there any poor surfaces like over here? Down this end, there is. Okay, well, that changes. That changes most things, doesn't it? Time portal here. Take this one. Why aren't the turrets like shooting me though? Probably from there the turrets will be able to see me and be shooting me. Alright, so then I need What do I need? I need to get up there on the light bridge, don't I? That's what I need to do. Mistakes were made because I need to actually traverse in the future. I am not still there. I have gone, walked out the door. These portals are going to move if I do that. <laughs> uh, Doctress has been waiting uh, to build his new PC, crazy. Position that one. Time portal here. Go through here. Um. 
Can I get that? Earth. Unless, <coughs> excuse me, did this instead. Time portal goes there. Uh, I shut the wrong portal. I shut the wrong portal. Treasure goes. What is going on, buddy? What is? All right, so I got to reset this. I think that's the solution, though. I think. There you are. If I can remember what I did. It's a big asking. It's a big ask. But. Through here. Change that to there. Blue portal there. Change dimensions like that. Leave the orange portal in place. Blue portal goes there. Then I can change this blue portal there. Where is my orange portal in this dimension? In this dimension, in the present, uh, in the present, future, present. Orange portal are over there. Yeah. That's it. Alright. Kind of got the idea, but um Yeah, wasn't quite how it, I thought it was going to pan out. Nicely but, done. And don't worry, you won't encounter out. any turrets between the test chambers. Except for these ones. Rip. At this point, you might It was the same sort of idea as what I was thinking. Nicely done. And don't worry, you won't encounter any turrets between the test chambers. Except for these ones. At this point, you might rightfully be asking yourself why we put you through all this. Yeah, why? why? This testing track was built as a failsafe. My job is Thank to ensure you. that testing can continue, no matter the circumstance. You see, this facility is largely controlled by right. one entity. For some reason, this entity seems completely unresponsive. 20? Years from now. That's why the future looks the way it does. We have lost all control, and we need to find a way to restore it. I want to see if I can get that component cube. Maybe. Man. This is why. <laughs> this is why I never speed around portal because this trick used to kill me on um, oh, the. It's a chamber in portal two with the loud noises intro. Right, maybe I can get it from here. Uh, let's stop playing about. Um, also, I think I may have found a trapping situation. 
I may have found a trapping situation. But it says I'm not trapped though. Okay. Doctor's getting through the airboats. So maybe I can get that companion cube just a lot easier. Rather than... Uh, I don't know. I might be able to get it. I did something like this. This. And I'll probably end up dying. But hey. What else do you expect? Quick enough. It's that part of the playthrough where I get royally distracted by something that's really don't need to be doing, but science. There we go. Companion cube dot get. Don't want to lose it. Ah, oh, rector, 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 rector. Terrible. How dare you not find the companion cube? Okay, we got laser fields. We got laser fields. CD from LP. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. All right, so think first off we need to get a cube in there right that'll give us a light bridge in that panel then we can use safe, right? Team spam with spoilers. Now, what we found before
Okay, uh, so what I'm going to do is this. I'm trying to think of the way we've used the mechanics and bits and pieces before. Um... What we found out before in that earlier chamber was that the um, uh, faith plate doesn't affect the position of this. So then what we can do is something along the lines of this. A bit too slow. But you get the idea. Okay, now I go into the past again, that's the future again. I was getting them messed up, bubbled up because of the way they are. Okay, now that gives me a flip panel. Now I don't think I need to touch the cubes again at this point. So, I'm gonna do something like this, there. thinking though um do we need to activate the light bridge in the future and bring it back to the past or the present if i had the light bridge here that would allow me to do that now the problem with that is the light bridge in the future doesn't give me that panel there and i got no way of activating that panel in the future
Yeah, I know that. Yeah, I, I know Tears Man. The, the 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 panel is the end, and the the light bridge works independently. Oh. Oh, sorry. Um. Wait, is that signage suggesting what I think it's suggesting? Hold on, I can't pick in a moment. from where I was, but... Okay. Do I th think... Possibly... All I need to do... Is... Well done. You have proven yourself to be quite capable. Keep going, and you might actually fulfill your true purpose in all this. Yeah, it was the um, the signage. The signage was the big clue, definitely. Seeing like the player flying through the portal signage. My point, my my theory to that was, I don't know how I would have been able to do it without doing it in the past. But there's no way to get both cubes in. Sorry, I keep saying the past. That you need to do it in the future, but there was no, there's no way, obviously, to get both cubes in the future. So I don't see how I would have been able to do that. But okay. you got there. You are in the home stretch now. Woohoo! Only a few stretch. more changes oh, until this testing course is over. Time to introduce the last new testing element. These aperture science excursion funnels will mostly work in both mostly timelines. Mostly work. Have fun exploring all your options in the next chamber. All right, then. Okay, so... Go here first, I guess, and get the cube. Cubes. Barrel. Okay, I'm gonna do the same again. So then we're going to want to we need a way up to here. Really. So I think this is where things and stuff come in with the these portals here, whereby maybe do. Let me think about this. I will want to do something like this perhaps. And 
ones then. Time portal. Now effectively actually, let's actually wait, 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 wait. Wait. Rewind. Now, that's not what I wanted to do. You're waiting. Bumbley is waiting. Everybody's waiting. So, um, what I just come to realize was we actually have both funnels, can't we? And I think if we was to have both funnels. Oh, Eddie, what's going on? Domino, what's going on? Not long, hope you well. Now that's updated that portal to there. Now I go and reset the portal to here. Uh, no, the videos, the video actually hasn't been published yet, Eddie. To be fair, so. Um, no, they are yet to listen to all your fantastic hints. Okay. So now I have that there. Could of course move this round, but I don't think we need to. I think I'm overcomplicating this, so yeah, we're done. We are done on this one. Just need to position this on the right place. That should be fine. And then boom. You break it then, Rector? I don't know. I, mean, like I, said, I don't know how the I don't know what the official solution is. So I did a win-win. The time-bending technology used to create these time portals is only stable in one specific configuration. We cannot choose the exact point in time to which the time portals will lead. We can only take a small glimpse of what the facility looks like 20 years from now. What exactly transpired is still unknown, but the data we collected points to a single rogue test subject. A single rogue test subject. That's probably me, right? Is this the one then, Eddie? Is this the one? It is not. Right, when does that... I mean, I bet the grating's different. No? Alright. Oh my god, are you kidding me? I mean, I'll be completely honest right now. This is sort of like my first freaking portal test right here. This is like... This is like maid stuff. I 
mean, this is just a bit, a little bit like, eh. In my opinion, at least. Hey, where are you going? The turn off. I'm rude. Uh, so from here we would do what? I guess I would just do that. Pull it back. And push it down on the button, right? It's all well and good doing that there, but I need to do that in the present, right? Well, yeah. Uh, and as Team Spen just said, doing it here is only going to get um, muddled once and, and changed once I go back into the present. But um, that was more just like a, an exploration, I guess, as to exactly what I needed to do. So let's actually do it now, I guess. Today. Uh, where am I going from that? Oh, I can't go in there. Totally missed my call in there, didn't I? Use Louise. Testing my solutions. Alright, so now we've done that, we can head on through to the other side. And it should be as simple as doing. Oh. Yes, no, no, that's, that's fine. That is fine, isn't it? Is it? I think it's fine. Yes, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> and she was like, she said to me a while ago. She was like, uh, "Do you uh, do you want a sticky toffee pudding for like dinner tonight?" I was like, "Yeah, sure, why not?" So she went out to go and buy one. And um, obviously she's been a while and not come back. So I just thought I'd ring and let you know where I am in case you're wondering where I'm like, e yeah, sure. I was really wondering where you are. All right, so now we go back, <laughs> now we go back here. And we're going to want to do that one to there. And... <laughs> Going to want to do oh fill sticks. Oh fill sticks. What now? What we can do though is that. Right? That does that do I need to respawn the cube though, or does it just magically appear? No, I do need to respawn the cube. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe I need to do this instead, actually. Yeah, I think because when it's in the funnel and the button, I don't think it really... It doesn't see it as updating positions because it's gone from where it was to where it was. So actually by hitting a surface there... 
it to put it in the right position. Okay, so uh, now we put it back to where it was before. I know that really sounds bad about my wife. <laughs> I do care. I do care where my wife is. I love her lots. So um, <laughs> don't get the wrong uh, impression from that, please. Uh, okay, so now I've done that. Now I need to move this. Now... Okay, I'm massively overcomplicating this. Let me just do this instead. Yeah, I used to. I used to smoke. Um, I quit. Actually, quit in two thousand and seven. So I've been quit for like fourteen years. I quit when they brought in the um, smoking ban in the UK, where you couldn't smoke in like public places because I really didn't like the thought of like having to go outside when I was in a social setting and leaving everybody else inside because most of my other friends didn't smoke. So I didn't like the idea of going out in a social setting and having to do like go somewhere completely different because I was the only one that smoked. So yeah, I decided to actually give up. In the event that something horrific were to happen to this facility in the future, keep my protocol is to find a viable candidate that can withstand the effects of time travel on the human uh, body Rector, can you and help to form, rectify please? whatever led to the tragic if events you know of not, the future. Let me know and I'll, uh, I'll do That's it. where you come in. We need you to stop this test subject dead in its tracks and save the facility. I are not. Oh, you've already uh, done it. That's fine. And you've already banned it. Thanks. I think it doesn't show on my... Um, it doesn't show on my uh, Streamlabs. I can still see the message, so... All right. On to the final. The finale. Yeah, no, it's fine. It says it's been... They said they've been um, banned anyway, so... Whatever you have done Welcome is the right the thing. the final chamber. Don't get overwhelmed. Take everything one step at a time, and you will soon find the solution. I will soon find the solution. And he got right to the end. Uh, this bit reminds me of one of the puzzles from Mel. Okay. You don't like needles, TG? Needles are my friend. I'm a regular blood donor, so um, the size of the needles they put in your arms there. No point being scared of needles. <laughs> you like knitting needles? <laughs> Alright, so okay, we, we've got mechanics here which are differing from 
didn't like this puzzle. There seems to be mixed reactions about this one. I don't know why having the time portal here, though. I don't really want the time portal there, do I? Because that would do absolutely nothing. It would be much better to have it somewhere... Here, I guess. Yeah, actually, that's probably the perfect position for it. If I'm honest. Alright, so then we're going to do that first, then that. We change that to the blue portal to go to there. Um, we've got a time portal to use, it seems. So we'll just do that. And what port did I say that was? I want orange. Time portal only, yet I can't shoot my time portal there. Fantastic. Oh, okay. So that has to be that. Okay. It's activated by the... I probably should have known that was the case. Um... Alright, team spend, no worries. Enjoy. Enjoy sleepy times. Wait, where did my cube go? Alright, well, the funnel's gonna do that and that, so how do I activate number three? It's the only kind of thing we need to figure out, I guess. So I just want to try here. Can I drop onto that time portal from up here? Hey, companion cube. Try and get you though. Don't believe I can, which is a shame. I do feel that what I need to do is reposition. So, my new thought process is... cube it's something. How much longer on the stream? Uh, well, fingers crossed as soon as we get this done, but got about another 20 minutes. Start the stream a little bit early. So this needs to go in the future, and I? I need to do this in the future.
But if that's the case, what was the point in me doing that? You don't even have to hit a portal. It just completely goes. Ah. Oh well. Screwed that up. I feel what I gotta do here though is and like this. And then Oh, but I'd need to set the pulse first in this side, wouldn't I? Do that and that. I keep getting laser collision off on this. So that would do that and that. Now... And then I can swap that to the funnel once I'm up the top there. That's all well and good. Oh, wait, okay. I, I think I see. I think I see. Okay, so actually, that is in line with that, isn't it? So, we position this one here, like so, and then we do, that still goes to there. And then, that one still goes to there. And how do I do the first? Uh, it's keep that, haven't I? So for me, the only question that remains is where does the, where does this cube go first? When I shoot, I... Go up, but I want the light bridge to be there as well. Now... I'm 
less. Unless... Unless I can somehow do the first two in the past, in the future. Then go through to the present. To set the portal. I don't think I can. But is there anything in the past that I can't do in the... I can see all the port surfaces. Right? So... Alright, maybe I'm massively overthinking. Okay, so we're going to do... Right, that move that position there. Alright, so... Step one. Do a thing. Step two. Do another thing. So, um, what was I thinking? I don't know, what was I thinking? I was thinking that that is not lined up correctly. I guess I didn't move it once I changed the light bridge position. Uh, what's going on in Deferential and also Megist? What's going on? Yeah, I'm starting to think that I can do everything from up the top. I just really think about my portal placements here. So that goes to there and that goes to there. Then here, I want to do that one to there and that one to there will work. Actually, I need to set the other ones first, don't I? Yes. All right, so actually they're in the right position. And that will go to there like so. Now, actually what I want to do is I want to... Do this for a save here, and this. Ah, I didn't set my port positions here though, did I? That cube moves very, very slowly. Very, very slowly indeed. Sorry, <laughs> I couldn't say that. Anemia. Now, I have a hunch that this portal is purposely slowed down. This is going to be quite tricky, isn't it, to do? Or is it? Hmm. 
Maybe not, because I could do instead... I could do that. That would work. That would work. All right, so. Let me go through into the here. Set the portal up here. Can't tell though from this like depth, I think. Oh, I'll stay in place at least, so Oh, I need to do that after though, don't I? Alright, so change that to there. And that to there and that to there. Nope, that is the right position. Excellent. Now I can get rid of my time portal. Set that to there. Okay. Now. I just do this, and we are done. Ish. All right, so I have a port there, so I can easily get back to here. Okay. Uh, actually, no. Oh, it's there. A stupid cube. Okay. Um, because I'm lazy. Because I am lazy, let's do that and wait a million hours, actual million hours, almost as long as a million love songs, but Well, I did just think then, actually, fumbly, weirdly enough, as that was going on, I saw, I heard that it caught the receiver, and I thought, did I really, like, throw that down there in, in like, exactly the right orientation for it to catch the catcher? Astonishing. You really did it. You've proven to be capable of nearly anything. Now it's time for your real mission. My real mission? We will put you back in stasis until the day of the incident, and you will be the one to prevent it. This vacuum tube will take you back to the long-term human storage vault. You will be awoken when the time comes to use your special abilities to save this facility from its impending doom. Uh, I don't think so. Time for that on my lunch break. <laughs> oh no, Paul's broke. I broke Paul. Warning, warning. You are going the wrong way. Please be aware that escaping is not an option here. You are far too important. 
If you won't go voluntarily, we will be forced to destroy your current body in order to put you back together in the stasis chamber. But this will be a small price to pay in order to help save the facility. Think of it as a sacrifice to science. Thank you and goodbye. No. Warning, you are deviating from your path. Facility power has reached critical levels. Critical levels. Connection unstable. Yeah, that's my work uh, VoIP phone. That was. Dumb. Did I escape? Is that it? Is that the end? I guess there's an ending if you go back into stasis then, right? It's not real. Oh my goodness. Head crab zombies. What the... <laughs> There we go. I see your name, Demon. I see your name. <laughs> Alright, well. Uh, what do we think about that? Well, it's, very, it's, it's a cool mod. It's a really, really cool mod. And definitely is a lot better with the... When you compare it to like, the way the time, time mechanics works and think of a time machine, it's a lot better... Um, it's portrayed a lot better and created a lot better and I think a lot more thought has gone into this. Um, what I would say though is with a lot of the puzzles, I kind of feel they're a little bit samey in that it's a case of you are using the future cube somewhere and then moving the present cube to kind of get it off the button. I think there's a good or five, so maybe six puzzles in there, which are kind of all using that same gimmick of moving the present cube to fizzle the past cube. Um, and to me, I found thought that like a lot of the solutions was a, a bit similar and a bit samey. Also, in the past, I have been quite critical of mods for being over tutorially. And as I touched on yesterday at the start of the stream yesterday, I feel like this could have done with a bit more, ironically because there was a couple of chambers, uh, I think it was chamber eight specifically, where I'd actually missed some of the dialogue that was being said at the beginning. And it was kind of like explaining what I need to do with like the whole portals where you can change them in the future and not affect the past, but if you change the past, it affects the future. And I, I kind of didn't get that straight away. And I kind of feel like a bit more of a tutorial kind of segment would have been a bit nicer. But overall, I really enjoyed the mod. Um, I think it's really good. Like I said, it's really well done. And it brings a definite interesting um, addition. Sorry, I'm trying to think of my words. Addition to the um, Portal gameplay. So, um, yeah. Anyway, guys, thank you very much, everybody, for watching and tuning in with this playthrough. I think the lunchtime streams will be continuing on Monday. We will go back to some unity chambers so um i've got quite a few on my list but yeah i want to kind of try and keep the momentum going on the lunchtime streams so yeah um monday 1 p.m bst we'll be back playing some portal community chambers so if you're around come by and say hi but if not i appreciate your support as always have a great weekend and until the next time i've been knock you've been awesome stay safe take care happy gaming